Hi guys, it's me Luke here, and today I'm here with Rebecca Morn, Miss Britain turned figure and PhD sponsor athlete. Today we have had a PhD nutrition sample day with a few of the new products, and before we go into that, I'll just quickly introduce Rebecca. So hi Rebecca, how's it going today? I'm not too bad, thank you. Awesome, okay. So I'm going to tell myself and obviously people watching, just a quick introduction about yourself. So I've been competing for the last year or so. Um, I, I started off with qualifier back in May, placed second in that one, straight to the Britons, won, won the Britain, and then I had a bit of time off over the summer, and then I competed just a few weeks ago now at the Nabe Turn Figure um, universe, where I placed top six, and I placed six in that one. So I'm just having a little bit of time off now, just to, to relax on my off season. Um, still eating quite clean and training, um, taking a little rest from, from training, so yeah, that's about it at the minute. Nice. Okay, and so you mentioned that you're going to have some time off now. I think a lot of times, especially like online, you don't really see that. So in terms of time off, is that something to recommend for most people? Or, I mean, obviously you can't be on the on all the time, or on season, yeah. I suppose, can you? Oh, I definitely, I definitely recommend that people, you know, take take a little bit of time off, or at least, you know, bring down the training days and train maybe three, three, four, five days a week instead of, you know, the typical six days a week, twice a day, every right. day. Um, and, you know, just be, be clean in your diet. But, you know, if, if you're craving certain foods, you know, don't, don't hold back. Definitely, definitely treat yourself because most importantly, <laughs> yeah, you need to keep quite, you know, like off season especially you need to be able to eat what you want so then you can get back to it and be strict. Yeah, I definitely agree with that, to be a bit more flexible because like you say, I think something that's important with diet is to have foods you want because if you're restricting yourself all the time it can lead yeah. to like a bad behaviour or a bad relationship with food I suppose if you yeah. like. So yeah, 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 you've got a bit of control as well. Obviously. I really agree <laughs> with that, yeah definitely. Awesome, okay so a few of the new products we've had today in the shop were the, the Peter Nutrition BMX2, so yeah. the new pre-workout and the casein peptide. So are they two things you've tried or what, what can you tell us yeah, about that? Yeah, um, my sponsors so kindly sent me um, the peptide and the VMX2. Um, tried both. I definitely recommend both, especially the peptide. It's something that I've always kept in my diet, especially um, my last meal of the, of the day, which is always the, the peptide. Previously I used a blend, so I've, I've exchanged that now in my diet. Um, and I've just added some good fats in there, which is my almonds. Um, VMX2, I wouldn't recommend myself using it every workout because I don't want to just rely on that for, you know, energy and, and, you know, more focus in the gym, but I would certainly use it maybe every other workout or maybe two or three times a week, just, um, you know, so it does give you a little bit of kick up the bum and you know, right. you get into the gym and yeah, it's, it's good focus. Yeah, okay, great. So, so not like maybe all the time, but yeah, like maybe for like, I don't know, like a workout or something that you want to get that cake, I suppose. Okay, good. Right, okay, well, thanks, there, Rebecca. That's been quite insightful and got some good information on the new products as well. So, thanks for watching, guys, and make sure to keep a lookout for some more videos coming up on our channel.